Hi. <clears throat> I'm back. Who won it? Who who won it? Which nigga little goon getting stewed with the onion? It's been a minute. You know, it's been like five days, seven days, six days, eight days, eight days, eight days, eight days. And I wanna talk. Obviously, there's always something that Riri mm, wants to talk about. So today I wanna talk about makeup that I hate. H-A-T-E. So the first one is lashes. <laughs> Lashes that aren't applied properly from the neck upwards looking dead, looking frass because you don't know how to do simple eyelashes. Simple eyelashes, you don't know how to do the friends that allow you to go out looking like a higgy, hagger, hoogie, hoogie. Your friends that allow you to go out with broomsticks like that. Why are the lashes facing upwards like that? Why are they not coming out like normal lashes? Please tell me. Please leave a comment below. Let me know why. No, I'm vexed. Second one is dirty eyelashes oh my goodness there's certain girls out there that feel as if they can use the same lashes from 2010 you can't you can't how is it so gloopy how can i tell that you've had them on all week no how please let me know you want to be out here in dalston at an event telling people yeah guys add me add me on Snap. no you need to sort out this first before anybody decides to add you rude Bright lipsticks with no lip liner. No, no, this is, um, no, it's, it's Tangerine by MAC. Sit down. We have a, let's walk out there and concentrate. Now, all my lips are really You look like a Terry Shook orange. How have you got this on your lips with no liner? The darkest area is the mouth, right? So, what makes you think that you can put an orange in the middle of a cement? Think about it. If round here is dark, like Homer, like Homer's beard, what makes you think that you can put this colour on without no lip liner? Without no lip liner. Oh. Harsh nose contour. So, I really, really pack it on. Really pack it on. To be honest, the whole point is to not look like yourself because basically I want my nose to, to be non-existent. Oh. You went from having a beef tomato no nose to now having a carrot. So imagine the width to now having a single carrot as a nose, all from contour. And you want to tell me that, you know, I don't really wear much makeup. Okay. Oh my God, this one, I nearly smashed my phone. Tampon eyebrows. I'm going to go in with a black. Because obviously people's eyebrows are natural. Begin the colour from the beginning. Because we want to make sure. So I like for it to be like a sperm. You see, it looks like it's gonna fly. I mean swim. So it's, we want it to look like it's gonna swim into the egg. Okay. You want to be coming here with tampon eyebrows. I feel like it's always the women who have tampon eyebrows are the ones that are always like, no, 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 I'm in the queue when you're going to get your eyebrows done. No, no, I'm first in the queue. Right, you shouldn't even be in the queue. Why are you not growing those out? How would you have so much hair at the beginning and none at the back? Why are your eyebrows swimming to the egg? Hmm? They're swimming to the egg. <sighs> Please, I thought, no, this has got to stop. All of this, what? Closure. I'm going to do a review on this hair. It was sent to me by um, BA Cosmetics. What do you mean what closure? I can see it. That one there. Are you trying to say that it looks like it's your hair? It doesn't look like it's your hair. I know it's a wig because last week you had no hair. Okay. I can see the grids in that parting. Hmm? This is why you shouldn't buy wigs on AliExpress and tell you that it's the Rihanna one. Look at the state of me. <gasps> Guys are not stupid either, they can tell. Let me tell you something, let me tell you a funny story. When I first started seeing my boyfriend, and I used to go to his house, I used to wear my wig to bed. I wore my wig to bed, to the point where the clip, you know the comb that goes at the back of your head? I used to leave it in. I used to leave, I used to connect it, secure it, everything, and go to bed. My man already knew it was a wig, so who was a fool him? There was a day where he said to me, babe, you know, you know you can take it off, you know, you know you don't have to go to bed with it. Sorry, you know, sorry, would you go to bed with what? 
guys are fully aware they know they know especially nowadays they're very aware of what you've got okay i'm reloaded lastly quick disclaimer this is obviously a joke um obviously no everything on the, in this video fully annoys me like fully i'm not even pretending um i've got a longer list but we're gonna be here all day so anyone who's offended by this mean i care just press the like button if you haven't already checked out my website it's rayellen.co.uk i'll leave it the link below and yeah thank you for watching say hello to your nanny for me okay tell her that i left the haggis near near the port <laughs>